right, Nayan, Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes, the box office weekend results are basically in. Um, so Deadline and Box Office Pro, they are reporting that the box office weekend for Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes will be 52 to 55 million. The international total is looking to be around 70 million. Um, so you're looking at around a worldwide opening of about 125 million worldwide. So to put this into context of the other eight movies of the recent era, so Rise of the Planet of the Apes was 54.8 million opening weekend. Dawn was 72.6 million opening weekend. War um, opened to 56.2 million for its opening weekend. Um, and as for the other ones, The Fall Guy, which fell flat last weekend, falls. So many jokes in this. Um, little puns I'm, here. I ain't biting. <laughs> it falls 48% to 14.4 million. So that's a good hold, surpassing 50 million now. Challenges rounds out its top three by dropping 34% to 5 million for the weekend for a 38 million total ahead of its streaming debut next weekend. So, Nayan, let's keep the focus on the Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes for this one, but it's looking like it might be the lowest opening weekend for an Apes movie, despite it being 13 years later than Rise. What yeah, are your thoughts on that? Yeah, it does look like that. I know that we did our projections um, earlier in the podcast and we're expecting mm-hmm. it to be under 50. It looks like if it's yeah. going to keep that ape streak of uh, mm-hmm. hitting that 50. But uh, it's still some, still what we expected. You know, we were expecting it to be lower than the previous three. Um, and it looks like as if it's tracking that way at the moment, unless it goes to that light, high end of 55. Um, mm-hmm. But yeah, nice to see it kept on track of that 50 million, but... Yeah. Who, who knows? These are only predi- predictions, or well, not really predictions, but like projections based on the Thursday, Friday sort of takings. So mm-hmm. it could be well yeah. less than that. Yeah. Well, I mean, Saturday is coming in now. Um, so I, I think you are looking at something at 50. Uh, plus, at least regardless of kind of, because just because Friday opened up so well, you, you had, um, I think, Wednesday and Thursday numbers part of that. So who knows? But. Yeah, we were looking at something under 50 million projections um, or tracking earlier on in the week suggested something under 50 million. So I think it's a positive thing that we are seeing over 50, but it's not promising that this franchise has not grown. Um, I did say Dawn for the Planet of the Apes, you know, that was 72 million, but then War, which released three years after that, went back down to that mid 50s mark. And you know, seven years later, we're still at the mid-50s. And you can count inflation. I think it's something that we should be considering and injecting as part of the discussion because if we want to use Rise as like, oh, yeah, it's about the same as Rise, no big deal. Well, if Rise opened today in those numbers or the same ticket sold, that's 76 million opening weekend. So it's not apples to apples there. But, yeah, this I think this franchise, its ceiling is dawn for the Planet of the Apes. I, I don't see this franchise growing. And we're going to talk about the future of this franchise in a little bit. But there seems to be a, a pretty heavy ceiling on um, this whole franchise. The fact that it's not growing at all, despite it getting amazing like reviews and great reception from everybody. It just can't grow. It's concerning a little bit. Um, as for that worldwide opening of 125, yeah, you might be... A, this is going to be an under 500 million worldwide movie, I think. Because mm-hmm. um, I was wrong the other day. It has opened in China. Um, oh, it's just not it doing great there. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, not too good. Um, yeah, all right. Uh, another thing. Oh, you guys, yeah, sorry about that. Um, what do you guys think about Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes, the box office results? Um, do you find 52 to 55 million for the weekend a good figure for this franchise? Um, or do you think it should be growing based on you know the, its reputation? That's actually pretty positive. Um, whatever you thought, whatever you think, leave it down below, and we'll get to 